Heads with Tear is pretty good. I'm down for Heads with Tear. It was Tinder with Belk, but I think I'm less inclined to start Belk right now. I don't mind as a tier because I've got bow. And it's just like, like as two is a okay, so I don't really mind tier on as at all. I definitely two star him. Yordles. I don't know what does. I can think about it though. As two can definitely kill some shit. I get like a bow. I get Rada definitely sell as. I get bow. No way, Jose. Nice. Cash money. Should I check what mutant is, huh? Oh, this looks kind of good. Where is a mutant? Oh, there is a mutant. I need. One sin, you should be have a really strong board, actually. Might be a gold opener. I don't look like it, no. Definitely don't want Heimer Ding Dong. I want a singed. We need Umbrellas really early this game. We need Umbrellas in a shiv really early this game if I want a streak. This board's not gonna have damage. Does it just make money ever? Why not? I actually like these. I can play. This. Do I want to play this. I have redemption. I should play this. I should 100% play this. We'll get Clockwork in eventually. Even on Adrenaline Rush, show is just good right now, right? It's gotta be the strongest board. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, things you hate. Oh, I thought it was hate. Made? Really? I mean, this clockwork guy on the board. Not a double level. I guess so much stronger. I think I'm 100% down to double level. But do I play Scrap or do I play Clockwork? I Scrap, Bruiser. A little better. How do I get Mutant in? I need to get Mutant and I get Clockwork in. But I'm going to be dead this game. I'm, not, I'm probably not actually just playing Miles this game. Or not playing Mutant. I'm just playing it early game, right? Oh, this Cho is kind of a monster. They just fall off a little bit. Hmm. I want this blitz. Oh well. Adrenaline rush here would not be bad. Definitely this. But it's not clock we're gonna level up. Mutant on level up, right? Four, six, eight, ten. Why make ten here? Oh no, I don't. I have stop pair. Don't make ten. Level five. They have redemption. I think it's really hard to lose. I could be totally wrong though. Just eat my words here. I'm not getting any augment value right now. Is the thing. Yeah, if if he ulted again, I probably win. My my uh my Cho'Gath. But Swain's basically a Cho'Gath. <laughs> I think like Swain is like essentially a Cho'Gath. I want here a rod. I'm surprised I lost that. That was really close. Belt. 
Well, just gonna give me the best scrap for the moment. Pull over though, so I'm not poor per se. Don't love the positioning. I have to move him up. Don't love me so the front line. I'm also worried about that matchup. I have to move him back again. Okay, it's good. He's zero on. Oh, Zephyr's not bad. Need Ziggs to do a little bit of work here, though. Trendle as well. Trendle one should be able to beat this. Yeah, nice. Yeah, we lost that last fight. If we got one last little redemption proc off, would have been really good. So my level, my level seven is clockwork. Really? I'm not a mutant for sure. I'm not a mutant. At some point here. It's a little too hard to pick clockwork for my liking. I kind of wish I kept the Ez now. Decent board though. Let's play clockwork mutant whichever one we hit first. Do do do. Is it worth it for trap claws, Eeks? Nope. Probably not. Probably not. Okay, we get shit on. Nice, the Morello's Trundle. Pogo. Our Trundle's stacking a bit, or our Cho'Gath's stacking a bit. I mean, I'm thinking I'm out of Mutant here. I could say a Mutant. But it wouldn't be great. It is a little bit though before I actually get out of mutant. I just say clockwork is plus one gold, right? Opium. Did I ever target me then? No, uh, that's fine. Sorry. I think that this lane was fine in the situation. I also think playing around Cho Mal's was fine. I could have made ten and then played around Innovator, but I didn't have actually have Innovator and I wouldn't have had it. So I'm happy with what I did. Would have been like Probably 80-ish HP here. Are we just going Frozen Heart? Wait. Why are we just go Frozen Heart? I'd probably go Bramble, right? Like Archangel GA. I can't slam anything. I'm fine with that. Oh, Choke Pair is amazing here. And down a level. I do get significantly stronger from leveling here. I don't really want to sell this because it's my level up. I lose a little too much gold though for leveling, probably. Could slam a Sunfire. Probably not correct. I just vibe for a turn. As much as I hate just vibing for a turn. Mm -mm -mm. Last Whisper TF, huh? Oh, Double Redemption's really good. Over time, she makes my front line fucking crazy, actually. Eat him? Fuck it. Oh, I wanted a stack. I could roll for Cho 2. Cho 2 is a win streak. Probably fell all of stage 3. Okay. That's also really good. That's high roll as fuck. I have a Cho too. Maybe I'm not dropping this Cho'Gath ever. So if I'm not dropping this Cho'Gath, what am I playing? Isa, ideally? Can I slam anything? The thing is, Frozen Heart would not be the worst thing in the world, but Bramble will be 10 times better. At least 10 times better. From this spot. I mean, I guess I really have to worry about Clockwork value if I don't want to. What would be the end of the world to not get clockwork value? I'm getting rat gapped. Not really. It's dead. <laughs> I have choke too. This guy's a fucking beast. So I, I probably prioritize Bramble then. Because if I get another chain, I can just look at a GA. I can also do AD Cho'Gath. Fuck it. And I think. Maybe not. Cho 3 is definitely a potential win condition though, right? Cho 3 plus Isa. Oh shit. 
I'm about to commit to this. Underdogs is really good here as well, though. I really like the idea of having Pogma pair, however. Oh, is it Underdogs ever? Underdog makes this Cho even more unkillable. Up to 150. I just go mute it. Just for Cog pair. A little bitch made. A little bitch made. The Cog 2 is like a big spike here. A lot of extra DPS. Did you start Cog Maw from the spot? Okay. Don't want nothing to get hooked. I wouldn't mind that getting hooked most of all. I think this is fine. Should be. Done a little walk up if I get one on the left. Problem with uh, Zig's far left here is I might get whacked by, um, by whatchamacallit, by like some frontline walking down and around. But, like this, they can never walk down and around, right? Okay, Cho got, Cho got some fucking beast. <laughs> this unit's a monster, man, huh? I think Munhar's gonna be the higher cap at the end of the game anyways, because I'm probably gonna have about as much units as everyone else by the end of the game. But I don't want to rely on I think, I think Underdogs is the more guaranteed win streak, but if I hit five mutant, I'm actually super strong in the game here. Definitely want Bramble. Bramble means I beat Kune no matter what. And it probably means I beat Broccoli no matter what as well. I mean it doesn't have a crit, he just has you know armor AD. Although some anti-heal would be nice, but I can't select Trundle yet. Just be Shiv. I mean, I, I just kind of want chains this game, in general. I want a lot of chains games. I want a GA as well. So I'm definitely looking to play Kaisa if I can. It's just like Mal's whatever into Kaisa. So we just slam the fuck out of this item and call it a day. All go. Yeah, that means we should be Q no matter what. Copium. Ori. I don't know what we were waiting for, isn't it? I need a protector spat for this guy. I could level and roll a little bit if I wanted to. Uh, do I need to to win? I don't need to win that matchup. I mean, I can just level. 24, I don't really need to. It's definitely overplaying. It's like 100% overplaying. There's no need to level. Doesn't even make me win by many more units. Is the thing. Although, do I ever just randomly lose to Ascension? I don't think so. I'm not getting any Adrenaline Rush rocks, though. There's one. I'll try not to take the bullet. Okay, yeah, it wouldn't have affected anything if I leveled. <laughs> it's such an overplay. I need a Mundo, though, pretty badly. Mundo or... I have to play Cassidy as well. I like 5 Moon here is actually pretty real. I think I hit Cog 2 ever. Oh, that's good. I'm out of level now. Because now this makes you a good bit stronger. I could have also played like four dudes. Make sure the talent gets caught on this Cho'Gath if I, if I run into him. Cho's kind of fat. Kind of popping off a bit. I'm glad. I mean, I said if I had redemption, there's no way I would have taken this Cho, right? I already kept the Cho, but I had redemption, so I think I had to take, keep the Cho. I'm glad I did. I didn't play him. Well, if I had Cho 3, I don't think Talon can kill it. I could be totally wrong, though. I am looking for Cho 3 this game. 100%. I'm going to catch Broccoli out. Hopefully not. Foundry player. We only have four, actually. I really want Cog, too. Another chain's good. Probably has to be Shiv. Oh, what the fuck? Probably has to be Shiv. Shiv Gargoyle from the spot. Just hitting everything naturally. I think Gargoyle's fine here, right? 
I think I've been building Gargoyle too much in general, though. So it's GA Morellos, ideally. I guess I go 8. I have too many shows to really want to roll. I can just big clump, right? Okay, he looks weak as fuck. I rolled Sunfire as well. It's really good. Because when I get to, uh, I, mean, I can just play this board with a Cho'Gath 3 and Jin, but it doesn't really make good use of Adrenaline Rush. It was like a different Yuin, maybe. It was a different Yuin, maybe. Hmm. I level one roll a bit here. Another mutant would be a pretty big spike. What else can I play though? If I'm rolling only for a mutant, I don't want to. Because again, I think I'm too strong to lose, and I need a lot of gold. I need like a ton of gold this game. I can definitely lose the player. I think I won't even mind losing that much, though. I'm gonna do this. Hopefully, it's not the only player. Yeah, because there's just there's a bunch of sins just chilling. I don't really want them to get stuck on my Kogma early into a fight kill him because he's my big dps source from here nice he's stuck on that guy Pokemon kills the rat and we're bing chilling imperial there i mean they're just looking for swain three. Oh, you still lost oh that's not good he needed the component didn't he what's his talent build we didn't. He did not need that component at all. <laughs> what am I talking about? Is that better than Arcanist? I'm pretty sure it's better than Arcanist. Dude, this Cho is so tiny compared to this Cho. What the fuck? Oh, I'm playing him as soon as he hit. That's not good. Maybe I can still win because Cho is just that broken. Fuck it. Cut it down. I need to get some procs, though. 2500 HP, 2200 HP, 2000. Ah. Uh, too bad I hit played him right as, as he hit. I think Cho 3 wins that, though, probably. Or just chose down the right. This fight's a little scary as well. That's a large flux. I really wanted a Morello's here. We will not be getting that. Not a trap claw are fine. The point doesn't matter for Kuhn, so there's no point denying, even though I don't know what I want. He has Pandora's. He's just looking for the most gold. Uh, do I roll? I still feel like I'm strong as fuck, actually. <laughs> I'm not agreed to. I have too much HP. All I really need is, like, if I hit one Kai'Sa, slash get a rod. I don't even need Kai'Sa. I just need Cho 3. Pretty sure I can just keep playing around this Kog'Maw. And it'd be fine. Really. Pretty positive. This here for the Yone player. Uh, they did not hit. I feel like they did not hit. Did ever just win? <laughs> yeah. Does Cho 3 do it for us? I mean, we need to get rid of this Trundle as well. Trundle Ziggs need to go. I think Scrap's still better than the Malzahar, though. And Ziggs 2 is fine. I don't want to say it's very stationary. Just because I'm running a, a massive front line. Oh. I play rolling on this level. So I'll roll a little bit now. I got armor plating. <laughs> I see. I got armor plating. Uh, this okay. I, I feel like don't I just win this match off armor plating now? Maybe. Maybe not. I have like a GA on my back line probably, but the problem is the owner's gonna actually come my back line. They're not gonna get resets though. They have Kaisa two on eight. 
Hmm. We're gonna win that later. I need to go nine, but I also need to hit this thing. It's our sides. I, mean, I had to play for the gin person as well, so that's fine. I mean, I don't think I win this. <laughs> Fine tells me I'm not winning this. I mean, they're 8 challenger with Kaisa 2, Yone 2, Fiora 2. That's armor plating gap, though, if I kill one. No? Okay. I, mean, I can just keep playing Jin the whole game. It's actually fine, isn't it? Yeah, pretty sure it's fine. Remember that. It's probably a trap claw. Do I need a Cho 3? Janna? Sounds weird. I think Scholars might be okay here, though. Ice Whisper's good. That's for trap claw. Okay. I want this in. That's for Drop Claw, right? Yeah, I don't mind rolling for this guy. I don't need to roll that quickly though, right? If I Jinx 2, I can play Jinx 2 as well. I'll also be a Gen 3 game, potentially. I don't hold everything I can play. Roll a 20. Can I play Jinx even from this spot? I feel like I can't play Jinx from this spot. But I really want to Jinx 2 on this board. There's no fucking way I want to Jinx 2 on this board. Realistically. I'll probably just stay 8 and I, I look for like a Cho 3 slash Jin 3. I think Jin 3 is like potentially fun, like uh, very doable here. Then I'll chill on my rolling. I can also 3 star this guy maybe, randomly. I'm guaranteed top 4, so I'll vibe. For a bit. But do you want to roll before the four costs are gone? I need Solus to die first though, right? Okay. Once Solus dies, I'll be okay. Look for sign. I mean, yeah, I'm just I'm staying eight for a while, for sure. I think nine really gives me much anyways. Okay, I find Kaisa on eight. Kaisa 2 is not a win condition without Amarellos or a GA. Probably lose this fight. I imagine. Oh, maybe Cho just wins. Okay, Cho just wins. No, he doesn't. Oh, I still have one more thing of armor plating, actually, though, don't I? I do. I do. <laughs> oh, me, oh, my. The fucking unit, man. I'm not gonna roll and play two star this guy. That's fine too. Honestly, it'd probably be Kaisa over Mundo. I think I need the damage of Malzahar probably. I don't think anyway. I think Kim's gonna switch. Can this Cho 2 do it? I don't think so. I'm Quinned. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have doubted him, because he's kind of doing it. Oh, shit, he did it! I win this? Okay, is Cho am I Cho every game? What the fuck? How did I win that? Huh? Wait, there's no fucking way. I think I'm Cho every game. Uh, GA is good, just because of the Kune ma just because of the, uh, the Soju and the Kune matchups. GA is really good here. Dix doesn't get too much value. BT is also really good because of those matchups, though. The GA probably being a, a smidge better. Don't need Umbrellos. Fights are quick. And heals fake here. BT is good, though. Ooh. Alright, I'm gonna just hit. Fuck it. Be an impatient idiot. Shop. I don't roll a 30. Or playing TK, right? Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Kaiser 218 again. <laughs> what the fuck? How's he getting Kaiser 218? Sion's infinite value here, though. And show three would have been so nice, because I, I guarantee when this would show three. Oh, I won anyways. Kind of weak. I'll go. I thought I rolled a 30 again. There's no point. I shouldn't have even rolled last turn. I got really impatient. Bad. <laughs> I mean, I just clump eventually for this matchup, and I think I'm chilling. I just clump now. Like, how did... Okay, these units are fucking ginormous, first of <laughs> all. Why are these units so fucking big? I, I feel like I'm, I'm putting them all in a can of beans or something. What the fuck? Hmm. Well, uh, we'll properly position when it's just the two of us. Although, I feel like Cho might just win this regardless. Because he, he's Bramble Cho. Once he, once I'm Cho 3, I'm pretty sure I don't need a position and I win this. I could be totally wrong, though. Might just depend on the mutant. I also just probably backline, but it doesn't really work into that matchup because of the Swain. Titans. Is that a Jin item? Is that a Scion item? Is that a Mundo item? A Jin item. Eh, it's probably a Scion item. There are two Kaisa 2s in the lobby. Both level 8. Uh, one's level, one is level 9, but was Kaisa 2 at 8. So I hit show three, and then we just vibe for a bit, probably. I mean, I'd like to have a three-star Jin. That's probably the easiest way to win the game. I could play this as well. I'd like to hit this Cho'Gath. That also might win the game. Be key until I hit Cho. Kind of down. Where is this unit? There he is. I didn't switch. All right, and then I cap out on this plus this, probably. Where does Chain even want to go? The Scion, probably. All right, Cho, or you got it. I almost call him Mundo. He's Cho Gath, not Mundo. Oh, yeah, I lost. Fine. I have infinite HP from this spot. I mean, I probably I, he's fifty gold. Oh, I think I lose that. Eight thousand HP. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Although I think I kind of don't want Scion Zephyr. I, I feel like I'd rather Cho Zephyr. I'm sure just let Mundo get Zephyr. BT is so good in this matchup. Dedge. Gian and I are playing the game for a while. <laughs> Gian and I are playing the game for a, a while. The problem is, is I have frontline my shit. I mean, I, I always need this guy backlines. I mean, I can do something like this. Problem is, how do I let the Cho always eat the Talon? Because I mean, the Talon gets stuck in the Cho, I just insta win no matter what. They move back. Nope. Dude, he's going on Jin next, isn't he? Oh, it doesn't matter. Cyan doesn't die either. I forgot I have... I have, uh... Okay, no, he did. That, that's annoying. But I do think I win. Okay, I do. Good. Let's choke out randomly dies, but I don't think he does. Is Gen 3 even a win condition from this spot? Oh, it's just frozen hard, isn't it? No, it's GA. Go in Sinspat. 
don't even want some spat. I just want a GA. <laughs> and again, I don't even worry about anything. But I can't even pick him up. Can I get him to 10,000 HP, you think? Probably not. 10,000 HP is asking a little much. I want a, what, a TK at level up, probably. I promise Talon has a hard time actually getting stuck on Cho'Gath. Talon has like a really hard time getting stuck on Cho'Gath. I feel like full on backline the guy. Oh, did I just win anyways? Oh, I might have. That was close. That was really close. I mean, maybe it is just a front line, the back line situation. It probably is. If I do this, doesn't it actually always get stuck on Cho, though? Let's try this for one turn. I'm pretty sure this makes it always get stuck on Cho, Gath. Because what if he goes here? He kills this, and then it go this walks up. Yeah. It should always get stuck on it. And I get stuck on Cho. I don't care. I don't care about Shroud. Shroud's really inconsequential in this matchup. It's just about where Talon goes. Okay, Talon's on Cho. Probably fine then. How much HP does this guy have? 9,000? Can I get him a 10k? What do you think? Can I be a 10k Andy here? Oh! I didn't mean to sell that! Whatever. I'm going 9. Fuck it. GG. Play some random shitter at 9. Madge. Madge. I did not mean to sell that. <laughs> he got a third shroud. <laughs> and I got another redemption. Redemption's good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Alright. Well, I'm just going 9. I'll play some random five cost. Doesn't really matter. Kaisa? The other gen I'm playing this Kaisa for sure. I'm three bruiser. Okay. What do you even want to play here, man? Really nothing good to play. I should maybe just roll down then. Maybe it's just a roll down angle. Is Cho dying? There's no way, right? I, I kind of am trusting him to stay alive the whole fight. If I'm being honest. Oh, he died. My Jin kind of did not do enough damage. Okay. I think Gen 2 is good. I mean, I guess I should just roll for Gen 3 then. I just play a second Gen 2. We're saying Kogma. Yeah. I didn't move my I didn't move my Cho. That's really bad. I did not move my Cho Gath. I thought I did. Oh, uh, Cyan goes all the way to the left, and we're on the... Oh, we're gonna be hitting this Talon pretty quickly. Maybe it's okay. Actually looking okay. Okay, we won. Good. We finally fucking won a game in a tournament, chat. You know how hard it was to win a game in a tournament? <laughs> Why was it so hard to win a tournament game? <laughs> That's like two tournaments, and I don't want a fucking game. Jesus. Padding Newton bottom right. I should have just rolled at eight. I thought I thought I'd win regardless. I'll be honest. <laughs>